All right, let's get back to Julie with, uh, well, it's been nice weather. Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh, it, it, it will continue to be nice weather, weather, easy for me to say, through much of the week. We're going to see a fluctuation in some clouds and some fog early in the morning, but overall, what you see is what you get, a pretty nice extended forecast. Let's go ahead and take a live look outside from your yellow camera. You can see we're starting to see a little bit of haze out there, um, and this, this view, I can't tell if the lens is dirty or if this is haze. It is sort of limiting the view there, but overall, we are going to see uh, a little bit more cloud cover tonight. It's going to help to keep us just slightly warmer for our overnight low still though on the chilly side. Let's go ahead and take a look at those current conditions right now. We're at 53 in Sacramento, 58 in Stockton, Modesto at 57, 55 in Marysville. Keep in mind our normal high temperature is somewhere between 55 and 56 in the valley. So certainly uh, we are above average for this time of year right now. Calm winds that's going to help for a little fog uh, production as we head into the overnight hours. In fact, taking a look at your current conditions across the region, you can see right now we're already just hovering near freezing for Truckee and South Lake Tahoe. Temperature is still near 60 degrees in San Francisco at this hour. Uh, we're at 55 in Fairfield Auburn. You're at 46 temperatures coming down there. 51 in San Andreas. Our high temperatures today topping out in the low 60s for Stockton and Modesto. Uh, I believe Stockton, the normal temperature for today's date is 50. Five, So we are significantly above that normal temperature for this time of year. Uh, Modesto, I believe, is 56. 24 hour temperature change kind of, uh, you know, varies from area to area. We're a little bit warmer for Stockton, Modesto, a little bit cooler in Fairfield, a little bit cooler in Auburn. And it's going to fluctuate as we see the cloud cover fluctuate from day to day. Valley lows overnight topping out in the upper 30s tonight. So like I said, a little bit warmer because we will have a little bit of cloud cover. Valley highs tomorrow. Once again, well above average for this time of year, five to 10 degrees, depending on where you are as we make our way through the week. 60, your high for Sacramento, Elk Grove, Tracy, Marysville, 61, Roseville, Folsom, Lodi, Stockton, Manteca. These are your valley highs heading up to the foothills. Temperatures overnight dipping down into the mid 40s, places like Pollock Pines, uh, Auburn at 43, 47, Placerville and Georgetown. Foothill highs tomorrow warming up into the low to mid 60, 65, Colfax, 64, Twain Hart, 65 and San Andreas. Now see Sierra overnight freezing for you. Chester, Quincy, right around the freezing mark there. Uh, we're at 29 in Reno, 21 in South Lake. We were in the teens earlier this week, so you can tell that cloud cover really helping to insulate us a little bit, acting as a blanket overnight. Sierra highs tomorrow, though, plenty of sunshine becoming mostly sunny. Uh, temperatures warming up into the mid 50s for many locations. Bay Area overnight dipping down to the mid 40s for San Francisco. Salinas 47, as well as in Monterey 40 for Concord and Livermore. Bay Area highs tomorrow warming up in the Similar range to us, uh, 60 Concord, 62 Livermore, Livermore, but look down to Monterey, Salinas hovering near 70 degrees in January, folks. Not bad if you like the warm weather. The extended forecast shows that we do continue to see this uh, these above average temperatures with plenty of sunshine. You know, the, the biggest change we're going to see this week, uh, increasing cloud cover Wednesday into Thursday with a little disturbances moving in. Clouds going to help to prevent the morning fog on Thursday morning. Be a little bit more gray for us and then clearing on out patchy fog Friday, Saturday. I think the most sunshine is going to be Sunday, but we will also see that fog in the morning and then really pleasant conditions, mild conditions with patchy fog already continuing on into next week. Curtis. All right, Julie, thanks.